Hello everybody and welcome back to the Minecraft Christmas Let's Play. I'm the Yankee Freak. Here we are on day four back at the mountain base. And I've done some work off camera. I did some more mining down in my little area. And I have found a few shiny blue rocks. I have two diamonds there. And I've already made a diamond pick. And we have everything we need to make an enchanting table. Which is a big step. So I'm ready to do that in just a moment. Uh, I will say right now that I don't have a lot of time to record this, so I will not be doing a lot of off-camera work like I normally do, even though I already did some. Um, so I think today my plan is going to be to basically make this enchanting table and, you know, come up and find a little area for it. And then maybe try to get my first level 30 enchantment in this episode on my pickaxe. I'm not sure exactly, but something will happen. Um, so let's find a little spot. I'll do this with you guys to put a little enchanting alcove. Um, I kind of like the idea of climbing up this mountain a little bit, like doing a little stair-steppy thing. Let's try that with uh, some some slabs. Grab some of these. Make some stone slabs here, and then make a little staircase winding around right here. Um, maybe start it there, or something. And then, or no, maybe something like this. I don't know. I'm think I'm coming up with this on the fly, so we'll figure this out. And then I want to make the thing somewhere like right around I don't know where this is hard um let's let's put that right in here maybe and then we'll build a little staircase stair steppy thing up to it so like that maybe and then we go right up here and then a slab there or something yeah that's good that works for me and then we'll give ourselves a little headspace here. And I do have all the books that I stole from the village. So we got a full book, sh uh, book set up. Oh, that's the ceiling. Let's go up one more block maybe then. I don't have any smooth stone. Um, you are going to be andesite for now. Um, okay, how do I want to do this then? Do we just go up another block? Like there instead, and then fill this in. I don't know what to do. I thought things were going to work perfectly. Maybe we just lower the ceiling. It's already a really short ceiling. Well, <laughs> this is awkward. I don't like the staircase either. Um... I kind of want it to go out a little bit more even like maybe I'll make that stair there and then that step there or no ugh thinking let's let's do that and then this one will be like there so then that means I still need one to connect them up. I mean, that's so close, though. God. I could just do two, like, right there, maybe. And then build up there. Okay. We'll do that for now. And the floor will be andesite. It's cave-like. Now we're good here. Okay. So, enchanting table will go here. Um, yeah, so today's Friday. It is going to be the first weekend of December. It's always a good time. Um, normally, there's, you know, in the holiday season, your weekends get pretty full with different events and things that you're, you're doing. Um, this weekend, I'm going to be selling Christmas trees, or, um, 
We've actually already sold the trees, but we're going to be helping people pick up the trees they ordered. Um, I was doing this as a fundraiser for something, and then tomorrow is the day that they pick up all the trees, so right now there are like 60-something trees sitting in an area, and we're going to help everybody pick them up and strap them to their cars and whatever they need to do. So that's that's Christmassy. That's a that's a nice little Christmas story for today. Uh, my iron pick broke. I was not prepared for this episode. All right. And yeah, no, nothing else really Christmassy this weekend. Um, you know, at this time of year, when you're a little kid, this is when you think about what you want for Christmas, but. Now I'm at a point in my life where I'm kind of th starting to think about what I'm going to be getting everybody, because that is a, a much tougher thing to decide than knowing what you want for Christmas, believe it or not. Well, that's the, uh, oh, yeah, that's my thing right here. Um, I'll fill this in in a sec. Okay. Um, yeah, I just I just feel like thinking of ideas of gifts to give other people is a lot harder than knowing what you want for Christmas, even though I'm really not good at making lists for Christmas. Even when I was a kid and my, my mom told me to make my list because my grandparents wanted to get me stuff, I was always very indecisive and didn't know what the heck I was talking about. Oh, let's not fall down there. Let's block that up. Okay. Um, this is about as deep as the room really needs to go. We'll put the enchanting table like there, and then we'll cut out a couple of these spots. That works. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I like that. And then we'll put some up there. Okay, cool. There's some more coal there. I'll mine that out in a sec, though. So let's craft the enchanting table, shall we? Um, I am missing a book. So I do have three leather. So we'll use that. We have some sugar cane. And there are books. I do need a bunch of wood. That's something I'm going to have to harvest for the bookshelves. But I'll do that off camera. Let's make the thing book, obsidian, diamonds. Boom. Um, and I am one leather short, so I will have to kill a cow, because I need 15 bookshelves that requires 45 books, and right now I only have enough for 44. But let's place this where it needs to go. The beautiful enchanting table. Aha. So, yeah, all my stuff will go around the edge here. So, yeah. I know I started telling a story about how it's hard to come up with ideas to give people for Christmas, but that was really the whole story I had. I had no, I was not going anywhere with that, so uh, you're not missing out on anything. I didn't forget. So I think my plan now is to go harvest wood and some other stuff and try to get another five levels maybe so we can enchant something before this episode ends. It's going to be another really short one. Sorry about that, but um, we will have some stuff done. I might try to build something, too. It depends how I feel. Um, but I will promise that I will be right back. All right, I'm back here, and I've done all my chores. I got myself up to level 30. I got the piece of leather I needed. We have 45 books now, ready to make some bookcases, chop down a bunch of trees, got some wood, and got some more food and I got to level 30 by the way I just went out in the field at nighttime and fought a bunch of mobs um, decided not to record that I feel like that would have been pretty dry so I am ready to enchant though let's go ahead and make our bookshelves let's convert a bunch of this over and 15 bookshelves custom made and we are ready to enchant. I've got everything I need on me. Hopefully this pick actually has a good enchantment thing. 
to go with it. Let's put these down. I always put them down. I put one in the corner and then three on either side. And then two extras in the corner. So like that. That looks nice, right? Yeah, it does. Alright, let's see what we got. Unbreaking three. That is absolute garbage. I'm gonna enchant something else. What is the iron pick? Unbreaking three. I wanted to get fortune. Sort of smite, that's pretty bad. Bow, power four bow, it's pretty bad. All this stuff is pretty bad, I will say. I will admit. Um dang it. Why does the game gotta be like that? Um, I don't have an extra book to enchant either. That's a bit anticlimactic, wouldn't you say? Um, what else could I try? I could do boots. I'm going to make a fresh pair of boots here and then see if we can get feather falling or something. I don't know. Because I might as well do a level 30 enchantment. It only takes up three levels. No, those are pretty bad too. I think I'm just going to have to level 1 enchant something to uh, to get a refresh on this and then have to get back up to level 30 again. Let's see. I think I can handle that. Let's see if we can make it a challenge to get up to level 30 on camera this go round without any problems. Ooh, efficiency 2 on level 1. Okay, I'll take that. So there we go. That'll help me when I'm strip mining anyway. Let's see if we can get to level 30 right here. So I was killing mobs overnight. I mined out some stuff in that cave already, so I can't go down there. I can go down here, though. Let's explore this little... this big drop here. There's some coal here. This is where I mined out gravel. Alright. Can we get there? It's, good. No, it's not going to be enough just from this coal, I'm pretty sure. But that would be cool if it was. I've got a little iron to smelt up too. Maybe I'll do that. Scrounging for levels in this early game. Man, I forgot how tedious it really was to get levels in this game. I, You know, I did play when it was the 50 level thing. And I just can't imagine going back to that. I mean, it didn't seem like that big a deal at the time because enchantments were like not so much of a necessity at the time. I don't know how else to say that, but that's really what the case was. They weren't, like, I don't know. I didn't use enchantments much back then, even though they existed. And when I did, it was to clear out levels that I had when I had way too many levels. There's a horse that wants really badly to enchant something. Um, yeah, so let's see how else we can get some levels. Horsey, you need to stay out of the way, okay? Alright. I do want to find, like, a spawner and get a saddle or something because I want to ride horses very badly. Um, there's some pigs. I can kill pigs. Let me smelt the iron, too, before I forget. Come on, we can do this. We're so close to getting up to the level we need. Oh, there's gold in here. That helps a little bit. Every little bit counts. Okay. Oh, we got iron in here. That's awesome. That is awesome. Okay. Um, consolidate some stuff here. Organization is the best. All right. Um, do we dare kill a couple pigs? I might. I might just do that. There's a pig up there still. It is almost nighttime. I don't really want to let it be nighttime again, though. It's kind of annoying to do that. There's bunnies. Is there any more coal I can mine? I know there's that coal in my mountain, but I like that there. It's nice for aesthetic purposes. Let's go back to in this cave and see if we can find any more level materials. There's some iron. It's good stuff. And dead end. Okay, good. Well, this will help anyway. I really want to get us a good enchantment in this episode. It's going to be very difficult, though. It's not being very cooperative in the random generation. 
Skeleton, you die now. Okay. There's more iron. Alright. We're getting there. Together. You know, I, I don't know if the amount that I'm cutting is too much. It doesn't feel like it's too much because all the stuff that I'm doing off camera is not stuff that I'd ever dream of doing on camera. But then at the same time, there's some stuff that I'm doing on camera, like what I'm doing right now. That is a little bit boring. But I mean, I, it's, it's hard to avoid. Minecraft, sometimes it seems like a boring game when you're just watching it. It's more about the what you want it's more about the uh the content creator that's that's the part that draws people in that's the part that's supposed to captivate and i'm trying my best to be captivating but it's not something that's natural for anybody really i mean it's it's transition period i'm four days into this um i'm expecting to get a little bit more used to it um yeah I suppose now is as good a time as any to mention that this is not my first go around at trying to record videos. I've definitely I've tried to start up series in the past and record and do the whole shebang. But nothing really lasted very long just because of time commitments and it is nighttime. Let's sleep. And you know, at first I was a lot less coherent than I am now, I guess. Um, it was, yeah, it was, you know, it was, it was bad commentary. I expected it to be bad when I first started. And, you know, as time, even when I, even when there's long breaks in between, it starts feeling more natural just talking to yourself in a room because, you know, you just get used to it. You feel like you're talking to somebody and it's not just spewing stuff out of your mouth. Um, so that that's, that's always a part that 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 was a big hump to get over in feeling more comfortable recording this should put us into that level 30 though all right so yeah i mean as these as the series goes on as everything happens i hope to get a lot more comfortable with just talking and building at the same time because at, right now i don't feel comfortable showing myself building something on camera without going, okay, let's see, what do I have to do here? Because I definitely notice that I'm doing that, and I'm not at that point where I can just go ahead and tell a story while um, I'm trying to build something. Uh, I can do I can do stuff like that while harvesting all my crops and stuff. But, you know, for the most part, I have quite a ways to go. But I, th I think this is good practice just for life I mean there's not a lot of situations where you have to record stuff but just just speaking when you're not comfortable can be helpful it's it's similar to public speaking even though it's the exact opposite but I think I think you gain similar experience from it and I think that's gonna help me in the long run too I mean it's it's at this point thinking long run that's, that's not something I can do. I, I made this series expecting it to be 25 days. And that's probably the longest that I've ever planned to do a series. And ever, if I continue a bit longer, it's probably going to be the longest series I've ever done. So, I, I'm excited to try to meet my goal of uploading a video every day. Um, you know, it's not it's not just the recording of the video. It's not just whatever you see. Uh, you know, there's all the off-camera stuff, and then all the the uploading stuff that I have to go through. I have to edit the video, you know, make the thumbnail, and this is the first time I've actually done real thumbnails too. So that's that was something I wanted to try to do because thumbnails are pretty handy things to have, and I think the thumbnail I came up with works pretty well for this series. I think it works pretty well. Um, and I like it. And yeah, it's just something different. It's just another little step to add on to the daily grind of trying to make a video. And I can't imagine people that have to do this all day long, posting four or five videos a day. I, I just can't imagine it. Um, 
so you know I, I'm not saying it's impossible but for right now the the one video the one short video a day is already tough enough for me to keep up with so I'm just gonna try to keep myself on that track and we'll see how far we get I, I really want to get this 25 days in a row I think I can do it so I think we're ready to enchant though I noticed we are at level 30 let's see unbreaking three this 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 thing just hates me. Sharpness four. It's not bad. Depth Strider three. I kind of want Depth Strider. Really want Depth Strider actually. Um, I'm gonna go for it. It's gonna be my first enchantment. I really wanted to get Fortune, but that's not gonna happen because this game sucks. Um, it's not it's not in a giving mood. I guess. Let's get Depth Strider boots for ourselves. Hopefully, it's not just Depth Strider boots. Ooh, yeah, I like those boots. I wish there was Feather Falling, but those are pretty nice boots. Protection 4, Unbreaking 3 on the Iron Boots. Let's go, let's go ahead and take them for a spin, shall we? We'll end off the episode this way. Running through water. Oh, yeah, look how fast we are. Just strolling through the pond, and then let's take them off and see how fast we go. Ugh. Oh, it's so painfully slow. How can I get across this little pond? I know. Depth Strider. So much faster. Okay. Well, I I really wish I got Fortune, because that would make everything go so much faster. But before next episode, I hope to have gathered more resources and done more preparation. And next time, I promise I will try to build something in the Snow Wonderland, because I know that's what this is really all about. And I have a few ideas in mind that I haven't really been able to put to use yet just because of resource limitations but i will make sure i can build something in the next episode but for now that's going to end my day four in the minecraft christmas let's play um yeah we didn't we did a little bit of stuff it was a short episode but i think we are doing okay anyway guys that is it See you guys next time. Have a good day. Happy holidays. Bye-bye.